close to two months ago now, we got a clutch of eggs from this pair of rat corn snakes. They are both half rat, half corn snakes, and they are 100% het for the scaleless gene, which means that by breeding them together, since the scaleless gene in snakes is just a basic recessive trait, by breeding these two heads together, about 25% of their babies should have no scales or very few scales on their back. And today is that big day where their babies, come here, oh, they're over here, their babies are starting to hatch. It's actually been about 24 hours since they've hatched. I didn't get a clip when they were first pipping their noses out. There are one, two, three, I think three. There's three that are completely out, and now it is time. Since it's been about 24 hours, we're gonna just peek inside the rest of the eggs since the rest of the babies are ready to come out. And we're going to take a very small razor blade and cut just a little opening on the top of the shell so that if the snake inside doesn't have a sharp enough egg tooth to get out on its own, we'll make an entrance for it so it can get out. I'm gonna put the parents back since they're gonna be absolutely no help at all when it comes to cutting open these eggs. So we're gonna put them back and then let's check out these babies. For those who are interested, we incubated this clutch literally on this shelf in this closet. It's actually a heated closet for our green tree pythons. And I just had the container sitting right on here where it sits at about 82 degrees Fahrenheit. And they hatched on day 60. Today's day 61, which is why we are cutting open the eggs and seeing what's inside. Huh. So the only ones that are out are scaled. It seems like those always hatch faster than the scaleless. Assuming we have some scaleless in here. Okay, let's take a peek. It looks like most of them have pipped. So we're just gonna peek inside and see what we get. Oh, look at that first one. That's a scaleless. Ooh, that's a, that's a really pretty scaleless too. Wow, look at the whites and oranges on that thing. Cool, all right, we do have a scale of this. Good, I was wondering since they were only scaled out. How about you? Oh, another scale less. Oh, that's his nose. Aw, he's just getting ready to poke his nose oh. out. All right, cool, another scale less. Oh, one's, one's escaping. Oh, I'm free! He's making a break for it. <laughs> Come back. No, don't escape. Come back, little baby. Oh, this one has a ghost head. Well, I don't know. I thought it looked like a ghost. Maybe it looks like a trident. I can see ghost. Think so? Yeah. And I always like to see what kind of shape their head stays are. Or a are. sword. <gasps> yeah. It's like a sword. Yeah. Oh, your name is Excalibur. Oh, this one has a heart. Kind of a heart. A very long heart. And an anchor on top. <laughs> Look, you've got v. the... Yeah, yeah V. <laughs> All yeah. right. So they're over there now. They're out of the way. So scale is scaleless. This one's empty. I'll just put you aside. Um, let's see. Next one that has pipped. Uh, this one has. This one is pipped. He pipped on the side for some reason, but he's still pipped. What's inside? <gasps> I see scales. Yep, got a little scale baby in there. Next. And by the way, the S's are the ones that I predicted would be scaleless. So we'll see how close I am. Scaleless, scaled. Yeah. How about you? That's oh, the same oh for anything. I didn't think of that. <laughs> you are. Oh, oh. Yep, I see scales. I see. Oh, but do we have lack of scales? I see what looks like a scaleless, but just with more scales than usual. Oh, so like a half. A half scaleless. Yeah, here, let me turn them. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Weird. Yeah. That's like glorified scaled. Yeah. Look at so that. Kind of wanted to be one, but not really. Okay, <laughs> next is, oh, that one hatched. Oh, if that one hatched, then it was a scaled, so my prediction yeah. was wrong. Unless the S was S for scaled. Yeah, S oh. meant S for scaled, not scaleless. I really want to know what's in this one. Yeah. I can't wait to open that one. I might. One. Yeah, it feels good. I'm going to save that one for the end. Okay. What's in here? You guys blow so many spit bubbles. I see scale. scales. Yep, we've got scales. Yep. Look at that. Scaled cool. baby. This is the last one that pipped on its own. What are you? Wait, what's the O stand for? I don't know what the O stood for. Only orange. Scaled? Orange. <laughs> <laughs> Only scaled. Yes. No, I think it stood for orange. I thought it was going to be an uh -huh. orange baby. Inside here, we get the bubbles out the way. Out the way. Get out the way. <laughs> Move, bubbles. Get out the way. Scale, baby! 
Now we have to cut open. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six, yeah, six. Okay, we're totally gonna save that moldy one till the end. But we yeah. left it in here because it looked good otherwise. And it still feels good. It does, so it might be a good baby. What's in here? This one just has an X. And like always, since there might be new people watching this, the blood isn't from me hitting the baby guys. Don't worry, those are from just the small veins that run on the underside of the eggshell, so that's normal. Let's see what we've got. I'm gonna, gonna guess scaled. I'm guessing scaleless. Oh, <gasps> scaleless! Uh, scaleless, yep. Look, Look at that. that. All right. I guess, yeah, ones that are scaleless tend to hatch a little bit later, so probably a good chance most of these uh -huh. are scaleless. Wonder if we're onto something. The scaleless ones take longer to hatch. Maybe. Huh. Watch, this next one's gonna be scaled. Yeah, this will be a scaled. <laughs> yeah, it'll throw that theory out of the window. Okay, we have. <gasps> wow, Whoa! That's gorgeous. Orange scaleless baby. Oh, oh my gosh. That is gonna be beautiful. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to see that one come out. Yeah. Holy cow. Nice. Ugh. Getting so stoked over this clutch, guys. How about this one? S for... <laughs> scaleless. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm gonna say scaleless. I'll say scaled because we only have hets. We've been dealing with hets and we got a That's lot true. of scaleless. Yeah, we're like beating the odds so far. All right, well, I'll go with scaleless. You go with scaled. And it's a... <gasps> scaleless! Wow. A white one. Whoa. <laughs> White-ish colored scaleless. Yeah. That's going to be pretty too. Man, these babies are going to be gorgeous. Same oh, he just here. poked his face out. That was adorable. Oh, oh. He just blew a bubble. Snap bubble. He blew another bubble. How about this one? This is a very tiny, cute little egg. I'm going to say scaled on this one. I'll say scaleless. Scaleless? Okay. You just want to be... wrong every time, so... <laughs> Well, then I should keep guessing scaleless because this is awesome, all the scaleless that we're getting. Let's see. The moment of truth. <gasps> Another scaleless! Wow. Oh my gosh! Are you sure this was head to head? Well, I mean, I did put the two head scaleless together, but I did last minute put that female with our scaleless male buck. And based on these percentages, I wonder if he actually is the dad instead of the het. I mean, otherwise we're just getting really good odds. Man. No, we're not that lucky either, No, so. we're not. That is a cool looking bit. You look weird. Are you alive? He's yeah. moving. Okay, yeah, all right. You're just a little funny looking. That's okay. Don't, don't uh, criticize people for being funny looking. They're snakes. <laughs> I mean, he has no skills. They're all kind of funny yeah, looking. Sure. Two left, guys. This is O. Oh, this is what I predicted. Only scaled. It only scaled you're going yep. with. Well, okay. I'll go with my original prediction of when I marked this with orange. I think this with is going to be... Or orange scaleless? Orange scaleless. Okay. Gotta be orange scaleless. We're going all the way. Go big or go home, right? Come on, orange scaleless. Come on, only scaleless. Didn't you say only scaled before? Scaled. <laughs> okay. I'm covering both my bases here, so I can get it right either way. I heard that. I caught you. Oh. <gasps> Scaled! You Hooray! got it! He's only scaled. I was completely wrong with that prediction. Yeah, completely. He's not even orange. He's not orange <laughs> or scaleless. He's just a normal, normal baby. But if Buck was the dad, he's head scaleless. Yeah. Time for the last egg. The moldy egg. I was thinking it looks like an old calloused foot. Like a really that. old man's foot, you know? Yeah. It's like, like a geode. It does look like a geode. It looks like a topographical map of Utah. All right, it's time to yeah. finally look inside of this Did This thing's actually egg. alive. Yeah, yes. egg. Yes, yeah. I don't know if I'll call it a baby yet. I'm just gonna refer to it. Oh, it's a tough shell, but look there at is the goop. goop. Yeah. The goop is clear. That's a great sign. Yes, it is. Oh, I see healthy, like, veins. Oh, it's really tough right there. Oh, yeah, you're hitting the, the geode part. <laughs> the foot part. Will it be alive, first off? Well, there's <gasps> something in there. It's definitely a scaled baby. Yeah, scaled baby. Is that your face or your tail? Are you alive? Me. Yeah, it's Yeah, moving. yeah. Looks alive. Wow, guys. Okay, we have a healthy baby in here. See, that's why we don't toss eggs if they look kind of questionable still, because they might still develop and hatch like this guy. Okay, what we're going to do... Oh, look! Scale his nose. Yeah. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Uh, sorry, distractions. Boop him. <gasps> Boop. <laughs> Back on target. <laughs> we get, don't get distracted at all. We're gonna let all these guys come out a little bit and check back in 24 hours and see what some of these beautiful babies, like that orange one, look like out of the shell. And I do really want to see what this moldy baby looks like out of the shell too. So we'll keep you posted and we'll check back in a day. Look at that pile of babies! 
That's a lot of babies. That is a lot of babies. I think they're out. Oh, I think they're all yeah, out. Look at that orange one right up front there. Wow, that is beautiful. Look at this white one, this white scaleless. It almost looks like, like white sided. Yeah. It looks up to the top. He's orange at the top. Orange head. This guy's like all mottled scaleless. That's so weird looking. Oh, weird. He's got like a ton of little individual scales in multiple places. Yeah. It looks like he has the um, uh, the scale issue from Game of Thrones. Oh, What's gray that? scale? Gray scale. It looks like he has gray scale. Whoa. You're so ugly. Oh, but, but beautiful he's at the same time. so ugly. He's cute. What else do we have? We've got the orange scaleless. That's a really nice scaleless. There's like a single line of scales down his back. Yeah, I see that. That's really kind of cool. This I one's making camera. a break for it. Go back in there. No! Crazy time! <sighs> oh, and I see one more down there. One more scale is coming out. Another orange. All the scaleless ones are orange. That's yeah, crazy. except for one white one in this yeah, clutch. Yeah. Oh, we woke him up. Okay, here they oh, go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Emily's got to ah. control all of them now. Oh, no. Come back. I'm not going to help at all. Thanks. Thanks. Ah, stop it, guys. I have to make sure ah. your crazy time is in focus. Are thanks. they all out? Here, you keep looking at that or hold them. Oh, thanks. I'm going to look and see if they're all out. Of the eggs? Oh, yeah, okay. like this one. Nope, there's a tail still in here. <gasps> Oh, moldy egg still in? Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh, he's out. Out, 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 out. Out, 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 Oh, so the last one is the moldy egg. Yeah, I'm gonna grab these tweezers and we're gonna look. But it looks like his tail came out and we didn't do that. No. So unless somebody, one of his siblings did something. Uh, we'll see. He's moving. Is he? Yeah. So you're saying he's alive, huh? Yep, if you poke his side, he sucks in. Really? Yep. Oh, he See? moved. He's oh. Only, so he's just like, no. He's very I much alive. I don't want to come into the world yet. Maybe he came he's out and went back in after he saw his siblings. Dude, okay. I'm really curious about you and if you're going to come out. All right, I'm going to put him back down here. There's a chance he might not come out because he hasn't yet. He is responding though, so he's still alive. So what we're going to do is we're going to take most of these babies out, but we're going to leave in a couple to slither on top of his egg to encourage him to hatch too. Uh, we'll leave uh, a scaleless and a scaled. There, there we go. Perfect. Encourage your brother to come out, guys. Yeah. And then... We are going to set up these babies in baby bins, but we have run into a problem. We are out of baby bins altogether in our baby rack. But thankfully, we own a bajillion Sterilite containers. This is what we incubated some bull snake eggs in, and it, since they hatch, this is going to be a perfect little baby bin. Here, go into that water dish. It's a cave. We're also running out of um, enrichment and things for them, <laughs> hides. So we're getting creative with uh, tubing and water dishes that double as caves. So that's just gonna have to work for now. So we're gonna go move all these into baby bins and we'll check in on this guy a yeah. later. Yeah, I really wanna know if he's gonna make it. Yeah, I guess time will tell. All right, we have part of the clutch here. These are the babies that have eaten at least a couple of times. I don't have the whole clutch out because it'd be impossible to like wrangle them all, but here you go. Here are some of the beautiful babies. Sadly, the one that was in its egg last did not come out of his moldy shell, so there might have been other issues with that baby that were uh, preventing him from developing normally. So he just never came out, unfortunately, but everyone who did come out looks fantastic. We've gotten most of them to eat, not all of them. Here's the guy with the sword on his head. He's doing great. He's actually one of the best eaters and one of the nicest scaleless examples in this clutch. He's looking awesome. I really like the white that's showing up around his uh, saddles down his back. Another baby that was really unique in this clutch was this guy. This is the one that had what looks like gray scale down his back. He's like a, a scaleless wannabe, but he's really unique it turns out because I mean he's technically a scaleless but I mean not a good example of one however it kind of makes him look like rougher textured and I'm really curious to see what he looks like as an adult oh yeah he's got that melon I'm sorry dude okay I'll put you down I think Ed's favorite in this clutch is this guy this little cutie is really calm and he has the cutest little black racing stripe down his back which contrasts really nicely with the orange scaleless well 
orange skin on the rest of his body. So this guy's one of our favorites too. But yeah, everybody's doing really well and they're gr growing quick. They're handling full pinkies. And actually these are gonna be, uh, some of them are going to their new homes here pretty soon because they've taken several meals now. It is too bad that that last baby in the moldy egg didn't hatch, but it's actually more common than you'd think for a baby to fully develop and then just never hatch. So there must have been something wrong with it. We'll never know what it was, but at least everybody else is doing great. Thank you everybody for watching today's scaleless baby rat corn video. And as always, thank you to our Patreon supporters for backing this channel. Stay tuned for still a couple more baby videos in the near future, and we'll see you next time.